Okay, y'all, so I'm back. And this one, I just figured I would just do as a video response. I don't know if they'll accept it or not, but I will definitely post the link below. Who is it? Okay. So this one is called Bad Mom Dance Dances with Kids. Now, it was made about a month or two ago, and I, I guess I just missed it, but someone sent it to me um, today. And when I look at this, this looks like this this mother is deranged. I'm seriously, y'all. When I look at her eyes and I look at how she comes on, it's like she's rolling or something. And a lot of you all will know what I'm talking about. You know, um, uh, either she, I mean, something's wrong with her. It's like, you know what I mean? Like something took over her like it ain't even her or whatever. Because surely to God, you can't be this ignorant. So this is the deal. She's dancing to some song or whatever in a nasty looking get up and her body looks even nastier in it. Poor baby. But that ain't even the issue at hand. And I and it's not like I'm trying to be the authority on fashion because here I am clearly sitting and get my pajama top whatever. But you will never catch me doing that. But I really think this is a woman that is sick. You know, because she's dancing to the video. She comes on and throws this horrible wig or whatever like this. And it's like her eyes, it's just like she's not there, y'all. It's like something kind of dark. I wanted to say, Lord, I rebuke her in the name, which I did rebuke her, y'all. I would just keep it real. I rebuked her in the name of Jesus. So, then, well, when it comes on, you see this little boy and... He's got these things like written over all over his face and then it goes to the mother and she's got the same thing on her face. And then she starts, you know, doing a whole bit and she's dancing and y'all. And at one point it looked like she's throwing macaroni on top of her. She got the little babies, you know, like making it rain, throwing dollars at her while she danced. Then one of her other baby comes, one of her other babies come. And she like puts her hand on his head and just, you know, just like, you know, I... I'm talking about like, she's like, hmm, take that, get it, you, you know, I'm like, what? Well, surely, I mean, if this can't be real, y'all, this bra goes to, she takes baby oil, yeah, I'm leg spray, and rubs it on her stomach, then she grabs this macaroni, a powder of juice, butter, whatever she's throwing, or whatever beverage, food, and she just puts it on her, y'all, but she's just in it, like, she's really in whatever zone she's in in her mind. But the sad part of it is that she would take her children, yet again, another fool, ass mother, exploiting her children just to get some views on YouTube? Girl, please, I revoke your license to use a uterus and a cervix area and for JJ. Right now, you done, no more babies for you. No more procreation. None. I'm, it's just done. This child should have never been able to mate, procreate, whatever. And with that being said, I'm going to need to put an APB out on these babies' daddies. Because from what I see looking at this broad and how she's acting, what was you thinking when you even slept with her? I mean, for real, it ain't enough drugs in the world. I mean, I'm saying, y'all, man, man. Men, there should be at least a minimum checklist of things you will not, you know, people, women that you will not sleep with just minimally that I won't do even if I haven't had sex in years. I just will not sleep with somebody that is like this along and that should be right up there with if she stinks, if she stinks for those who would say much love to ghetto because y'all somebody said to somebody that much love her. She ghetto. I'm just keeping it real. But don't get it twisted, boo-boo. Let me add this in here. Much love's been educated. This is just where I'm at. I'm comfortable enough at 41 to kick back and be able to say what I want to say. Now, if you want me to get on here and be stiff and be proper at every moment, I could. No, I can't give you that. But if I wanted to, I could. But with that being said, enough with that public announcement to the boo-boo who said that. But 
I'm just like, with all of this going on and the fact that she done this, this can't be the first thing that she exuded showing that she was just an unfit mother. Now, y'all, I am not one that's wholeheartedly for the Child Protective Service because I believe children should be with their family. But clearly, this is a mother who is sick in the head. She is deranged. She is mental. And if somebody don't get these babies or something don't happen and get her some help, Y'all, for real, I'm going to say this is somewhat a help of sister because y'all need to watch the video. And then every, all of us, we just need to pray for this sister. We need to rebuke whatever's in her, up out of her. Yes, we, yeah. Ladies I'm gonna need, and, and gentlemen, I'm going to need y'all to get the olive oil. We're going to have to get it going. Because this woman is clearly out of it. Elvis done left it, just nothing there. She gone. She gone, y'all. Just a man just gone up there. Somewhere, cause she what what y'all? It's a mouth. My job got too many clothes to be dealing with mouths. I can't do it. So anywho, yeah, I'm gonna need y'all to watch this. Like I said, I'm doing it as a video response, and the part the video that's up the the channel that you're going to. This person is not the person who is not the mother. This is just a person that is just putting the video on here from off the world style hip hop so it is not the person who this is not the mama doing the macaroni and the baby oil and ugh. anywho so y'all be sure to check it out please check it out and y'all please 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 pray for this sister pray for these children pray for all of these mothers that have lost their ever loving minds seriously the little girl who was doing the cat stacks, and I don't know how her mother could have ever thought that was okay. So what, cat stacks is her role model? Come on now. Ladies, get it together. You know what I mean? The moment you find out you're pregnant, even if the day before that you was an ignorant ass heifer, when you find out that you're about to bring life in, all that stuff needs to be put aside. You need to be raising your children to be productive members of society. First off, get your babies the hell up off of YouTube with all the perverts on here. Now, and I'm going to have to get into Miss Girl with the cat stacks again. With all the perverts on here that look on here, because it's all kinds of freaks on YouTube. You would lay your baby out there for her to be gawked at. You just an ignorant fool, too. And I hope to God you see my video. I got to believe that you are out of your ever-loving mind. See, because to me, doing that is putting your child in danger. I mean, for real. Did you think about that? Or did you just think about video views? Girl, it's about to go viral, girl. I'm going be a YouTube. I'm the next YouTube something. Girl, please live in the real world. And YouTube is just something we do. You know what I mean, boo-boo? Same thing for this mama that's doing what she's doing, but she's just a mental basket case. So, you know, but you putting your baby up to all of that, you about as low as they get, baby girl. You really are. I can't even, I can't even do a help of sister out for you. I can't even say my sister. I hope I, I, what I, what I do think is that you have lost your ever loving mind and you need your video camera, your computer taken from you. And all of that. Get your baby up off of YouTube. Are you crazy? Anyway, y'all. Y'all check that out. I done got into their craziness. <sighs> they drama enough. So, whatever. Anyway, so y'all check it out. I will post it below in case they don't accept the video response right away. So, much love. I'm out of here. I do have some help of sisters out. And for those who have sent it and helped a couple of brothers out, I will be getting those out. This was the week of my family reunion. So, please forgive me. And much love gets a little bit tired. And much love has been a whole lot sick. But with that being said, we're going to rebuke that sickness in the name of Jesus. I ain't even going to claim it. So, y'all, check it out. Much love. I'm out. Bye.